Sean, TUSD has proposed a boundary change for Ross Cruz students. If it happens, that would mean there's no homeschool area where students who live in that area are required to go to that school. So students who are at Ross Cruz could decide to go somewhere else. The purpose of this potential no boundary area is to support the dual language program. TUSD wants to make sure there are students in that program who really want to be in it. So if there are students who want to be in it but live in a different area, they can apply. Students who are already at the school and happy with the dual language program can stay. But if they decide they want to go to regular school within TUSD, they can and will have transportation to that school. TUSD is taking steps to improve programs that we have. And they're looking at how we can improve services to parents. And I think this one does both of those. By giving parents choice and by making sure that the program is successful because all of the people in it are going to be engaged in it. Now he says the only reason they would turn someone away is if they're in an upper grade and they aren't proficient in Spanish because the program is 70% Spanish. So, for example, a fifth grade student who isn't proficient is going to struggle. Now, there are meetings tonight and tomorrow that anyone can go to, and April is when the decision should be made. You can go to our website for info on those meetings. That's kvoa.com.